Good morning. As I have gone around the estate over the last couple of weeks, I've seen so many elaborate and bright displays of light. Some are very subtle, some frankly not. Some are tasteful, some might be considered tacky, although maybe who am I to judge? Some are very attractive, some are a little bit off-putting because they are so bright uh, and so flashing. But at this time of year, when there are so many hours of darkness, it is lovely to see all these lights around in the darkness. And I know I'm biased, but my favourite is definitely the star on the top of our church building. You see it as you come along St John's Road, floating seemingly up in the sky. And it reminds us of the star that guided a few wise travellers from far away to Jesus 2,000 years ago. And of course, we have it on our building for the same reason. We want it to guide people at this time towards Jesus. Today's verse, in him was life and that life was the light of all humankind, is part of the familiar passage that is often read at Christmas. It reminds us that the one to whom the shining star points is himself light, light that can shine into dark places, light that can reveal truth and bring grace and peace. He's available for all humankind. In him is life, life in all its fullness. I pray for you this week, as indeed always, I pray that the light of Jesus will brighten up your life at Christmas time and into the new year. God bless you.